And we're live at the 2012 ISWA Greco-Roman State Championships. Where we have Jesse Goodnight of CIA in the blue singlet. Going up against John Tatum in the red singlet from CIA and Humphrey Wrestling. To contest this Junior 160 Greco State Championship. As John Tatum comes here. As the Hamilton Southeastern High School. Sectional champion. Regional champion. And he plays sixth in the high school state championships in 2012. So no score left yet with just under a minute left in this first period. Tatum, as action has stopped, and Goodnight is warned to bring his head up. Tatum was the 2011 Greco State Champion. So he's looking to come in here and repeat as we go to a forced position. We're in good night on the bottom, has to defend. And Tatum must score. If Tatum fails to score here, good night will be awarded the point. Will be given the point and awarded the period. So as we work towards the out of bounds, the referee calls stop to the action to bring him back to center. As six seconds remain on the clock. And the referee restarts in the neutral position. And one point is awarded. To Jesse Goodnight, giving him the period victory. So now the break is over, and we're back for the second period. And as we start, the action heats up. As both wrestlers try to get the inside position, now Tatum, with a two-on-one, attempts to push Goodnight out and does, gaining the point. So Tatum goes up one to zero. And thus, there is a score, and when it comes down to 30 seconds, will not go to the forced position. And as Jesse applies the front headlock now, now with a whizzer, 
is in danger of going over, but doesn't, and gets up before he gets called, but then goes back down. So another point scored here by Tatum to go up 2-0 to zero with 55 seconds left. As Tatum looks to force a third period here. Not much action. Not much action here. As Goodnight now gets to a two-on-one here, with 25 seconds left, and now a duck under attempt. But Tatum doesn't allow it to happen. Tatum looks as though he's ready to. In the period here, taking the victory and going to the third period. So now we go to the third period, tied up one to one. And these, these two junior 160s are going to come out here. And they are going to go for this Greco State Championship. And in freestyle and Greco, the wrestlers are to be presented for the restart of the bout. dry and not wet, greasy, or oily, thus causing slippage during an application of a hold. So 15 seconds have gone by here in this third period. In an awkward position here as there, may be six more feet there might be there might be an attempt here by one of these wrestlers to push each other out. And the referee calling a haltage and warning both wrestlers and corners to tell their wrestlers to bring their head up. And now Tatum attempts to go inside here with an underhook. And now content with double overs. Working his way back in as Goodnight applies the collar tie. Tatum tried to go to a two on one there. And then a drag. And now a drag by Goodnight. So nice hand fighting technique being used here to try to gain the advantage before the 30 second mark where there, there's only five seconds before the 30 second mark. As Tatum glances at the clock. And now we must look at the criteria and total number of points scored throughout the match to determine the position of the wrestlers as first criterion. And Tatum chooses to take the down position, forcing Goodnight into a score position or be forced to lose this match. So Goodnight must score here. And Tatum has to have good defense. And in doing so, in 10 seconds, Goodnight with a gut wrench, but not enough as John Tatum 
is your 2012 ISWA Greco-Roman State Champion at Junior 160.